first off, it's bullshit. Like it. Like 40 years. Whatever the fuck. Die. Do you want to die? Because this is dangerous. If we. It is an ambulance. A keen observation, Crystal. Shut up, Edwin. Hold up a tick. I think I know this ambulance. Danny? Is that you? You know an ambulance? It used to be a street. They want us to go with them. We should go. Danny's aces. We're in the middle. We'll totally still be there when we get back. Wow, look at these two. Dear Lord. Ugh, small bandages from here, can't I? Oh, no. You can hear the boys? You're ghosts, and you're standing right in front of us. Now, Danny recommended you. That we are. Here to solve any and all supernatural mysteries. Hauntings, curses, otherworldly creatures, anything strange, really. We're selectively here to solve mysteries. How old is this house? Uh, well, we have to eat. You have to eat, they don't eat. Okay. Stay, and you'll be paid fairly. Deal? Why would you do this? I, I, I don't know, comfort? Hey, geez. You lot sent the magical ambulance to get us. Okay, let's get down to business to... She has damage. Shut it, Edwin. Or, you know, I'm... Home. Dad, mommy, then. Yeah? If Rita is reaching out, she might still be conscious. That means bandages here is the conduit. What do they do? Charles has a stockpile... Generally upsetting shit. Baseball bat. Because we're in the States. Mind your business. Just FYI. They need a cabinet particularly. Yeah. But if this is Rita, what does that mean? We're trapped in! Trust me. Sounds like the Tunnel of Souls. They're still being processed. So they're not gone? Technically? You'll be okay. Right, that is not the plan. Wait, wait! Wait, we can't. Right, we're going. I think. Maybe we should help. Oh, you know death is looking for us. Being over is a big ask. We don't usually go in for that sort of thing, Crystal, and you know it. Whoa, hold up, hold up. There's an actual death? Mind your business. This is what I'm talking about. Yes. And Charles will protect you. <laughs> I don't need Charles to protect well, me. Well, any moment, no. You want to be like those guys from the detective novels? I also vote we help. What? Sorry. I vote you help, too. You don't get a vote. Fine. I feel absolutely gutted, Crystal. There he is. There's a brave lad. <sighs> okay, Larry, we'll go with you. And Teresa will be a bit of a flashlight in the dark. <laughs> Love this. Your astral project, so your soul will leave your body. Ow! Fuck! What? what did you just... We enter here. Stick close to us. Edwin has a proper knowledge of how things work over on this side. More like a road to the afterlife. It's a road to a lot of places. But Edwin's been dead since 1916, so he spent a lot of time here. And that bat is in case we see death? Okay, I get that you're doing the very adult thing of using humor to hide anxiety, right? Death's quite nice, actually. And she is super fit. It's the things that work for her you have to worry about. Okay, this tree is terrifying. It must be where we're headed. Now we enter the afterlife. But... Well, you don't have to do that, Edwin. We can find another way in. What? That's nice of you. It's just... You see that lever? I have to pull it. Charles never officially crossed over when he died, and I'm the only one this place knows. Be a right shit detective if it didn't. Hold this, please. Right. He's afraid of water. I'm scared. Just so you know. 
All right, just so we're clear. Died of hypothermia in a lake, but anything for a case, right? That river can sod off. There's a lad. No worries at all. Um, if this is the part where I'm a flashlight... Like that. She's good. In theory? Fuck it, if we know, mate. Hope you aren't counting on us for this part. Right, so, uh, we doing this, or...? Rita. It's a proper hug. I'll tell you later. Steady now, we're in for it. Watch us. Watch it? What do we do? It's the States. It's an American afterlife. I'm using the bat. Okay. Oh, thank God. Larry? Lee, it's not actually me. It's an astral projection of me. I... Yep. Okay, time. Which way's home? Yeah, I'm thinking you shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Who's that lady? That's not a lady. She works for death and she's not here for you. Edwin, almost bed checks. Oh, I'm not letting her anywhere near you, Edwin. You got that. <laughs> I've got quite a collection in my bag. And my thing, in it. <laughs> ah! Do whatever she bleeding wants her. We need to get to the river now. to a family I've ever really had. But she's leaving. <laughs> Losers. <laughs> that was patently for all of us. Subtlety's really not your strong suit. Guess you're a lot like really all severe and moody and pessimistic. Maybe we are. <laughs> <laughs>